welcome friends in this new video uh, we see how to find how to solve simultaneous differential equation by using Laplace transform so let us take example suppose we have two examples dx by dt dx by dt plus y equal to 0 and dy by dt plus x minus x minus x equal to 0 with initial condition x at 0 equal to 1 y at 0 equal to 0 so remember that when we solve any differential equation we need initial condition by using Laplace transforms so here again initial conditions are given x at 0 equal to 1 and y at 0 equal to 0 so taking Laplace transforms we write it as uh, x dash plus y equal to 0 equation number 1 and y dash minus x equal to 0 equation number 2 so first take laplace transform on both sides taking laplace transforms of equation 1 and 2 so here laplace transform of x dash plus Laplace transform of y equal to 0 x dash we have first derivative so yes into we denote x bar what is x bar Laplace transform of x is equal to x bar Laplace transform of y equal to y bar minus x at 0 plus y bar equal to Equal to 0 this is my third equation and from the second equation applying the Laplace transform y dash minus L of x equal to 0 so s into y bar minus y at 0 minus x bar equal to 0 okay this is my fourth equation now we put the initial values put x at 0 equal to 1 in equation number 3 and y at 0 y at 0 equal to 0 in equation 4 then what we get s into x bar plus y bar equal to 1 x bar x at 0 equal to 1 minus and transform to this side so we get this equation number 5 then s yes into y bar minus x bar equal to 0 equation number 6 now we have to solve equation 5 and 6 so we multiply bar. we remain or we put we take as it is so s square s yes, square y bar minus as it is y bar plus s into x bar equal to 1 if we add this here x bar x bar get cancel and we get x s square plus 1 y bar equal to 1 so this gives us y bar equal to 1 divided by s square plus 1 and uh, here y equal to l inverse of 1 divided by s square plus 1 s square plus 1 uh, this is nothing but sine of t now uh, multiply the first equation by s square 5 equation number 5 uh, by s yes. so s into x bar s square plus plus s into y bar equal to s yes and uh, then minus x bar 
plus s into y bar equal to 0 we subtract this minus minus plus minus and this will be 0 so y bar y bar cancel and we get s square plus 1 into x bar equal to yes and uh, here what we get here x bar equal to x bar equal to s divided by s square plus 1 and x equal to l inverse of s divided by s square plus 1 this is nothing but cos of t okay so friend you have seen that how uh, we can solve the equations simultaneous equations with initial conditions let us take one more example suppose uh, the equations are d plus 1 y1 plus d minus 1 y2 equal to e raised to minus t and second equation d plus 2 y1 plus d plus 1 y2 equal to e raised to t these are the two e equations and initial conditions are y1 at 0 equal to 1 y2 at 0 equal to 0 so we can see that um, we have to solve this equation y2 uh, so first uh, more, let's suppose this is equation number 1 this is equation number 2 we will cancel uh, y2 uh, to cancel y2 we multiply equation 1 by d plus 1 so we get here d plus 1 whole square y1 plus d plus 1 into d minus 1 y2 equal to d plus 1 into e raised to minus 2 and second equation by d minus 1 so here d minus 1 into d plus 2 into y1 plus d plus 1 d minus 1 y2 equal to d minus 1 e raised to t and let us subtract subtracting uh, sign will be changed minus minus and minus you can see that this term will get cancelled and we get here d plus 1 whole square plus uh, minus minus d square or minus d minus 1 d plus 2 whole multiplied by y1 equal to derivative of e raised to minus t e raised to minus t into minus 1 plus e raised to minus t minus derivative of e raised to t is e raised to t minus minus plus e raised to t okay now let us take solve this d square d plus 1 whole square that is d square plus 2d plus 1 uh, this is minus sign here so we have minus d square minus 2d minus minus plus d minus minus plus 2 this is operating on y1 okay uh, then this e raised to minus t plus and e raised to minus t uh, minus this is equal to 0 high here is again we get 0 now uh, you can see that uh, in the right side left side d square find this d square uh, we will cancel 2d and minus 2d we get cancel and we have d plus 3 y1 equal to 0 or dy1 by dt plus 3y1 equal to 0 now taking Laplace transform here let us take Laplace transforms uh, then uh, Laplace transform of this so s yes into y1 bar 
minus y1 at 0 plus 3 into y1 bar equal to 0 y1 uh, at 0 is equal to 1 so let us put this value then you can see that here's plus 3 into y1 bar equal to 1 or y1 bar equal to 1 divided by s plus 3 and y1 equal to l inverse of 1 divided by s plus 3 and this is nothing but e raised to minus 3t this is the standard formula now we put this value in equation number 1 put y1 equal to e raised to minus 3t in 1 so if we put d plus 1 into e raised to minus 3t plus d minus 1 into y2 equal to e raised to minus t derivative of e raised to minus 3t is minus 3 e raised to minus 3t plus uh, e raised to minus 3t plus dy2 divided by dt minus y2 equal to e raised to minus t so here you can see that minus 3 plus 1 minus 2 minus 2 and we transfer this term to right side uh, right side and we get dy2 divided by dt minus y2 equal to e raised to minus t plus 2 into e raised to minus 3t now take Laplace transform of this so we get s into y2 bar minus y2 at 0 minus y2 bar equal to Laplace transform of e raised to minus t e raised to minus t 1 divided by s plus 1 plus 2 divided by s plus 3 Laplace transform of these two terms okay uh, then substituting this value here we have one solution now uh, you can see how we have obtained the solution of this let us uh, put y2 at 0 equal to 0 in this equation if we put y2 at 0 equal to 0 we get uh, s minus 1 s minus 1 y2 bar equal to equal to 1 divided by s plus 1 plus 2 divided by s plus 3 y2 bar equal to 1 divided by s minus 1 and s plus 1 s square minus 1 square plus 2 divided by s minus 1 s plus 3 equal to 1 divided by s square minus 1 plus 2 divided by s square plus 3s minus s minus 3 equal to 1 divided by s square minus 1 plus 2 divided by s square plus 2s minus 3 right so this is equal to y2 equal to l inverse of 1 divided by s square minus 1 plus s uh, 2 divided by s square plus 2s plus 1 minus 4 so this is expansion of s plus 1 whole square equal to uh, separating this you can uh, so this is what standard formula sine hyperbolic of t plus l inverse of 2 divided by s plus 1 whole square minus 2 square now applying the first shifting property equal to sin h t plus e raised to minus t into l inverse of 2 divided by s square minus 2 square okay equal to sin h t plus 2 into e raised to minus t uh, and this is equal to 1 by 1 by 2 into sin h 2t to, to, to get q 
cancel and we get finally y2 equal to sin h t plus e raised to minus t into sin h 2 t. So this is the answer of this problem sin h 2 t. So here you can see that how we have applied the uh, Laplace transforms to solve the simultaneous differential equations. Thank you friend. Thank you for watching the video.